So here we are with 30 Seconds to Mars. We hope you're having a good time at home. Put down that for a second because we want to take a minute to introduce a band that we've actually toured with. We uh, did Lollapalooza right. with, with them in 2003. The final touring Lollapalooza. Mm -hmm. We haven't covered too many songs as a band, and we covered a song one time. Mountain Song. Mountain Song, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. At Roseland mm -hmm. in New York. Uh, this is a band that they're they're tr they're true originals and they've always marched to the beat of their own drum. They're they're uh, amazing group. Chains Addiction. We're thirty seconds to Mars, and next up at number twenty is us. Thirty seconds to Mars. Go figure. I don't know what you really say about yourself. I mean, other than uh, thank you guys uh, so much for. Uh, for watching, for hanging out. This is number 20. We hope you're having a, a pretty good time doing what you're doing at home, whatever you're doing. Who knows what you're doing there, sitting on your couches I know or you're. in front of um, having the sordid things that could be happening. 30 seconds to Mars. Right, so all this American rockness is tiring us out, so we're going to have a quick power nap and then get back to you in three. See you then. Welcome back. We hope that you are snuggled up in your snuggy and not too drunk or So put down that and join us as we attempt to guide you through our 50 greatest U.S. rock stars of all time. So at number 17 is the one, the only Queens of the Stone Age. Yeah, there's nothing better than uh, a bit of suspense and surprise in life. So make sure you come back after the break where something possibly amazing will be waiting for you. That this next video is even better than that. Trust us. Trust us. Stick around. So number 13 is Rage Against the Machine. They are returning to the UK at Download Fest, uh, which we are also playing. I don't know which night they're on, which night we're on, but uh, they're a great band. I saw them at the first Coachella, first or second Coachella. It was them and then Tool, and Maynard came out and sang the song with Rage. Mm, that was awesome. It was, it was great because uh, uh, homie picked Maynard up. It was like dancing around with him for a second. It was hilarious. Here they are, Rage Against the Machine. Hey, thanks for watching. We're going to take a quick break, so grab a hot dog or some Coca-Cola, put on a pair of Levi's, and join us in the Top 50 U.S. Artists. Hey, welcome back to our Top 50 U.S. Rock Stars. We're 30 seconds to Mars, and if you don't like this one, well, you can have your money back. At number 10, we have entered the Top 10 Stars and Stripes American Rock Bands. This is hallowed ground here. This is territory that only the truly great are allowed to enter. At number 10 is the one, the only, Smashing Dashing Pumpkins. It's been a long, fun day here. Five hours of madness, five hours of music, five hours of fun. Five hours of fun. We're in the top 10 now. Very special territory. And this is a band I know means a lot to these guys. It's my, one of my brother's favorite bands when he was young. Definitely. He was Definitely. Listening. Ride the Lightning territory. He used to put the album on with this leather glove and rock out. Oh, I would. I'd headbang, man. Mm -hmm. Me and all my friends. Oh, yeah. I mean, they were so different for that time, too. There was so, everything else was, uh, I mean, just, it was just, they're so heavy and crazy. They brought, they brought this, like, punk kind of metal to the scene. And, Remember how uh, creepy the video for one was? Yeah, one. That was later on. Yeah. And one was like a deck. I mean, Shannon, I remember Shannon yeah. was sitting. It was 83. Master of Puppets was the big, it got big. Yeah, that was like 87, 88, yep. Yeah. But Shannon before, was listening to Metallica when I was still in diapers. True story. <laughs> anyway, and I'm only 28. Good. <laughs> Here is uh, the number nine. Metallica. So it's time for another break, uh, and we're going to do what Americans do and do well. We're going to, you know, eat a hamburger.
hamburger, drink a shake, have a Coca-Cola, play some baseball, join the Church of Scientology, that kind of thing. So we'll see you in a little bit. Hey, welcome back to our top 50 U.S. rock stars. We're 30 seconds to Mars, and if you don't like this one, well, you're just plain crazy. We're number seven, yeah. so we're back, and this next uh, band is really, uh, I mean, they made a huge impact in New York in the 80s, and uh, uh, in a lot of different ways. Very mm -hmm. inspiring. It's Blondie. Hey, we're 30 Seconds to Mars, and at number six, we have a legend, a, a master craftsman. Mm, definitely. A fellow six-string rebel, Tomo. Yep. Jimi Hendrix. Yeah. We used to have their aunt, my mom, actually. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. where we used to always yeah. listen to my mom's Hendrix records. Uh, I think my mom met Hendrix once, but that's another story. Yeah. Just a reminder, this is Shannon, this beast in the middle, Raul. I am... <laughs> Uh, and we are 30 seconds to Mars. We're, 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 we basically spent the day here skipping school and uh, playing hooky, hanging out, playing some of our favorite artists from the States, uh, the top 50 master list. We are in the top 10 realm, and right now we're going to play uh, an impactful artist, uh, an artist who really defined a generation who's kind of a, a voice of the people. Bruce... Bruce. Bruce. Right, so all this American rockness is tiring us out, so we're going to have a quick power nap and then get back to you in three. See you then. Hey, it's Jared, Shannon, and Tomo. There is absolutely no time for us to chit-chat, I'm afraid, because there is a serious amount of U.S. rock stars to get through. So next we have a band you're not going to want to miss. We're getting closer and closer to the finish line now. We're 30 seconds to Mars, and we hope that you've enjoyed this this uh, five hours of, of madness. We're, we're watching basically, uh, you know, some American classics. Uh, this next artist is uh, a true American original, uh, and you know, a career that spans decades and decades, and up to his death, he was creating, you know, unique, honest. Uh, wonderful music here's Johnny Cash so we're back and we are still 30 seconds to Mars you are watching our pick for the top 50 US rock stars uh, we're at number two it's been a lot of fun hanging out we're getting close to the end and we are very excited to introduce a band which I saw a few days ago in New York City and I have to say his voice sounded incredible I mean, it was incredible. It was amazing. You went too, right? I didn't go. Yeah, oh, you didn't go? No. The it was, it was, place was oh, packed. It was insane. The energy was amazing. I heard it was amazing. Yeah, it was uh, phenomenal. So, here's Guns N' Roses. Yeah, there's nothing better than uh, a bit of suspense and surprise in life. So make sure you come back after the break where something possibly amazing will be waiting for you. So here we are. At the very end, thank you so much. Goodbye on behalf of Tomo and Shannon. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Thanks goodbye. for hanging out with us. Thank We're you. very sad that we have come to the end of the top 50 U.S. rock stars. Uh, if you've been here the whole time, the whole five hours, we salute you. And if not, you can kiss our <laughs>